should be having hey, that. Hey, hey, my mind right. Wait, no, hey, no, 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 no. You, we got that fight coming up. You gotta beat it, bro. Yo, what is up, everyone? I'm back with some more insane boxing drama, and this time it's not even in the ring, it's going down right at Floyd Mayweather's crib. Yeah, you heard that right. The champ himself, Floyd Money Mayweather, just gave Grant Tank Davis a fistful right in his own living room. CNN even picked this up, and when the big outlets start talking, things just got real. First things first, let's break down what led to this heavyweight level altercation. It all went down at Floyd Mayweather's house and there's a lot of history here that made this pop off. If you've been following the drama, you know things between Floyd and Grant have been tense lately. Grant Davis was one of Floyd's star protégés. Floyd pretty much mentored him, took him under his wing, and helped make him a major name in the sport. But somewhere along the way, things got messy like mentor versus student, but with way more punches. It's giving a classic clash of egos, turning besties into enemies. So how did this escalate? Grant decided to show up at Floyd's mansion uninvited, bringing a few of his homies along. He probably thought they were about to have a calm, grown-up conversation, but that's not how it went down. Sources say Grant wasn't exactly invited, but he let himself into Floyd's house anyway. Things got heated fast as the two exchanged words. Suddenly, Floyd swung first one clean shot straight to Grant's jaw. Tank didn't go down, but he was definitely stunned for a hot second. We're talking about Mayweather here, his fists are practically weapons. Here's the million dollar question. Why did Floyd snap like that? Floyd is usually the guy who keeps it calm and collected, always maintaining his undefeated, untouchable image. But it seems Grant really struck a nerve this time. Sources close to Floyd say that Grant brought up some personal stuff, things about Floyd's family, which triggered the physical response. It's like a ticking time bomb ready to explode. On one hand, you have Floyd wanting respect and loyalty. On the other, Grant seeking independence and to step out of Floyd's shadow. This clash of egos was inevitable, and now it has erupted into a physical confrontation. Grant Davis shared his side of the story, emphasizing his loyalty and support for Floyd. I've always been there for him from day one. We had a game plan, and my goal was to help him become a world champion and take things to the next level, Grant said. I've always been positive, always said great things about him, always pushed him to be great. But over the years, he's been disrespectful, constantly taking shots at me. I've always been respectful and supportive, but he's been crossing lines. But it doesn't stop there. Grant revealed some shocking news. Floyd Mayweather allegedly hired guys to jump him while he was out on runs. Yes, you heard that right. Mayweather spied on Grant and even shared his whereabouts with Grant's previous opponent, Frank Martin. Frank Martin was the one who spilled the beans, but Floyd didn't stop there, Grant explained. He outed all of my moves to Frank Martin. I was running at 5 o'clock, and he told Frank to watch my people while I was running. It's like he's trying to sabotage me. Grant's trainer, Calvin Ford, broke his silence on the beef, making it clear that karma is going to catch up to Floyd Mayweather. Floyd knew that the showdown would expose him, so he played dirty, Ford stated. He couldn't handle the thought of being embarrassed by Grant in the ring, so he took drastic measures to ensure the fight never happened. Floyd resorted to nasty tactics to keep this blockbuster bout from seeing the light of day. Floyd Mayweather's motivation seemed to center around protecting his legacy and maintaining control. Known for his fierce competitiveness and desire to remain undefeated, Floyd doesn't want anyone to outshine him. Floyd is always chasing greatness, said Ford. He doesn't want anyone to take his spotlight, and if Grant becomes too successful, Floyd feels threatened. That's why he went to such lengths to undermine Grant. Despite the animosity, Grant remains determined and focused on his career. His longtime friend and former mentor, Deontay Wilder, has always had Grant's back. I was in his camp with him when he was getting ready for Mayweather, Wilder shared. I saw firsthand how much Grant has evolved. He's a smart fighter with incredible power. I support him 100%. Other fighters like Shocker Stevenson and Ryan Garcia have also weighed in, expressing their respect for Grant's abilities. Grant is a top-tier fighter, said Stevenson. His power and technique are unmatched. I believe he'll come out on top against anyone. 
Interestingly, Floyd Mayweather has also joined forces with Grant's biggest enemy, Shocker Stevenson. Floyd and Shocker are now working together in the gym, sporing and training. This unexpected alliance adds another layer of complexity to the situation. When Floyd and Shocker are in the same room, you know they're plotting something against Grant, one insider revealed. This collaboration is seen as Floyd's strategic move to counter Grant's rising prominence in the boxing world. Grant Davis's latest sparring sessions have shown that he's turning into an absolute powerhouse. His sparring partners describe his punches as having the force of a freight train. Grant's punches hit harder and faster than anyone I've ever faced, one sparring partner commented. It feels like the ground shakes with every hit. He's on a different level right now. Rumors suggest that Grant has been focusing on new techniques to amplify his power. He's developing punches that could probably break down a wall, another insider noted. The buzz around Grant isn't just hype, it's genuine. Everyone who's seen him train lately can't stop talking about it. Beyond his raw power, Grant has also improved his defensive skills. During the sparring session, I was expecting his power to be overwhelming from the start, one partner said. But as I started attacking and setting up my punches, he surprised me with his upper body movement and leg work. It was a technical fight, and his defense was excellent. He's not just throwing punches, he's strategizing and anticipating moves. This combination of speed, power, and technique makes Grant Davis a formidable opponent. His ability to blend these elements seamlessly is what sets him apart from other fighters. He's an intelligent fighter, the sparring partner added. He doesn't rely solely on power, he's got the skills to back it up. It's not easy to hit this guy. Boxing legends are already predicting the outcome of the upcoming fight. Many believe that Bivol's superior technique and focus will give him the edge over Better Beeve's knockout power. However, there are those who still respect Better Beeve's abilities and acknowledge that he could put up a tough fight. Better Beeve is a great fighter, said one boxing analyst. He's tough and skilled, but Bivol's strength and focus might be too much for him to handle. Dimitri Bivol is preparing meticulously for the fight focusing on his own skills rather than studying Better Beeve's past fights. I didn't watch any of his videos, Bivol admitted when asked about his preparation. I'm just focused on my own game plan because I know it's enough to win. This approach highlights Bivol's confidence in his abilities and his belief that his own training is sufficient to secure victory. Arthur Better Beeve, known for his devastating knockout power, remains composed despite the challenges. I don't make predictions he stated in an interview. I just focus on doing my job in the ring. Better Beeve understands the importance of maintaining focus and not getting distracted by external pressures or the hype surrounding the fight. His calm demeanor belies the fierce competitor within, ready to unleash his power when the time comes. Fans are divided and excited about the upcoming fight. Some are firmly in Bivol's corner, believing that his technique and confidence will lead him to victory. Others remain loyal to Better Beeve, confident in his knockout power and ability to end fights decisively. The anticipation is building as both fighters prepare to showcase their skills in what promises to be a historic showdown. The altercation between Grant Davis and Floyd Mayweather also highlights the complex dynamics of mentorship and betrayal in the boxing world. Floyd's role as Grant's mentor-turned-adversary adds a dramatic